Lauren from Lauren Phelps Designs. And I am so, so excited to share with you the items in the LPD Fall 21 release. Uh, I have five new collections releasing. Go through them with you right now. So let's get started. Okay, first of all, this is the thank you card. Uh, it says fall is my favorite in the signature LPD font. And if you noticed, these are completely exclusive LPD doodles for fall. Uh, so the front is this gorgeous dash card and on the back it has some nice information about the shop and about me and thanking you so much for your order. So these will be coming in all the orders uh, through tomorrow's release. The first set being the pink porcelain collection. There will be two bundles. One bundle will have all the items and the under, other bundle will just be washi. So the first item is these amazing vellum sticky notes. This is my standard 135 GSM vellum paper. These are not foiled, but they do have a very, very light grid on them if you can see that. And they are just gorgeous, very saturated and beautiful. And I really, really love them. So they were really fun. So I'm just stick that up there. Next, we have our tippins. And in true fashion, these are all vellum tippins. You can see they're straight on the edge. And this one, this is the uh, stunning one of the set, is foiled in rose gold foil. And it is beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Uh, so three in a set, and they also come with my standard original tip and tape. One vinyl decal, it says fall, it's like in the pumpkin spice collection. It's like your pumpkin spice latte. It is a waterproof, uh, permanent adhesive, uh, clear, so on transparent paper, a vinyl decal. So you can put that anywhere. Uh, that is the one for this collection. Now you'll notice that this sticker sheet's missing a few things. Well, that's because I realized once I did this TikTok the other day that I used this sticker off this sheet and then this one off of for this <laughs> and apparently I only had one sheet of it but that being said I have a second set of stickers same situation as the first this is the spooky kind of ghost one that second sticker right there is in this place right here and I just didn't realize I only had one <laughs> uh, so yeah so this is, see these little ghosts and they have like this little cute stippling on the bottom and then this candle opera is really, really stunning as well. Uh, so that is the second sticker. So I have some more die cuts. Let's move these things out of the way. One is this stunning candle opera. Uh, it has a, f a straight edge on one side so that it is easy to put in any notebook or even punched for rings. Then we have this beautiful pumpkin stack, uh, the uh, leopard pumpkins and the orange pumpkin and the pink pumpkin, which is in fact where the name for this collection came from. Did you know that a pink pumpkin is actually called a pink porcelain pumpkin? And that is where the name for this whole set came from was pink porcelain pumpkins. So that's why it's named pink porcelain. Now this one though, this is a favorite. It is these little cute ghosts. They're kind of like spooky. This one's like flying, but they are foiled and they are debossed with rose gold foil. And they are so, so cute, so beautiful. So I'm very, very excited about them. All you wanna know about is the washi. Well, here we go. Like I said, I always have them pre-print to make sure the colors are correct and I do not have the whole thing of washi, but here is the gorgeous rose gold foiled washi. We have the cheetah up here at the top. We have the zebra. Then we have this 30, gorgeous 30 milligram, 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 gorgeous 30 millimeter washi. Then we have these cute little ghosts. Can you see the little ghosts in there? So cute. The pumpkins with the orange pumpkin and everything and then these cool candles like how spooky are those little candle operas floating with their little shadows and then we have like more of a neutral floral and then these candy corn rainbows so if you like candy corn those are your candy corn rainbows and then they have the little ghosts flying throughout I did put it in my stology so here is what it looks like on the page look at that gorgeous foiling in this really, really beautiful rose gold foil detail. So there is that and there is the bottom. Uh, this one doesn't seem to be on my, <laughs> apparently that one's not on here, but this is my favorite one out of the whole set. These like beautiful daisies. It's a 30 milligram, 
millimeter washi <laughs> and it is just stunning so i'm really excited to be bringing uh these wash yep you guessed it I am bringing a stamp washi. This is a foiled stamp washi. It has seven different stamps. It will be perforated with the standard stamp type dots. Um, but like I said, I just have the test prints until the washi gets here, hopefully tomorrow before release. Uh, if not, I'm not that worried about it. I won't be shipping till at least Monday. So it has till Monday to get here. Uh, but I was expecting it earlier this week. So this is the stamp washi in the pink porcelain collection. And just so you can kind of see what type of foiling you're expecting, I went ahead and I printed out uh, some of the foil details. So everything that you see that's black on here will actually be all stunningly foiled. And you can see that the colors are muted, but beautifully classic at the same time. Now, two of my most favorite items are the vellum in this set. Look at that vellum shimmer. This vellum is 135 GSM vellum. It is super crinkly and it actually is debossed, which means that the foil is pushed into the vellum, which which means that the back has this so cool texture to it. I love debossed foil and it is just so fun and so much texture and it brings such life to your notebook or uh, your ring planner or as a, a stacking piece or a layering piece. This one is just a classic. So this is a leopard print with rose gold foil. And then my favorite out of the entire set is this stunning debossed floral vellum. It is just so, so beautiful. And I am so excited. So many fun items in this collection. The stickers, the tippins. Uh, I'm just super, super stoked. Uh, this was a labor of love and I hope you love how it turned out. So that's pink porcelain. Let's move on to the next one. All right, next. Let's welcome Quilson. Quilson is our regular little hedgehog and she is featured in the Hedgy collection. Uh, she is so cute with her little floral clown. Um, she has quickly become a fan favorite and if you're gonna want her, you're gonna wanna grab her soon. So this is Miss Hedgy. She has two vinyl stickers and these are actually vinyl decals. They are the clear transparent matte vinyl. So she has a full sticker sheet and just like the other stickers, I have used a few of them on this dashboard. A set of tippins and you know what? I'm gonna move these just over to the sides so that we can really just enjoy the beauty of these vellum tippins. These are not foiled, but they are that beautiful 135 GSM vellum and with three designs perfectly laid out to fit in uh, any notebook or planner. If you punch them, they could be um, used for a ring planner, but they are just absolutely stunning. Um, great print quality, really saturated prints. And I mean, seriously, look at this face. She's so cute. Just like with the other washi, I did not get the washi. There is five washies in the Hedgy collection and they are foiled in light gold foil and really, really, really beautiful. Quilson has her own stamp. And as you can see from the washi stamp uh, test, it is this gorgeous like craft color. Um, it's like a craft color washi back with this beautiful like light gray. I can't really even explain it, but it will have light gold foil and it is so stunning. Look how cute she is right there. Ugh, so cute. So that is the stamp and here is what the uh, foil overlay looks like on the stamp washi. And as you can see, each one of the little stamps are different sizes. So they're not all the same size. One's a little, the middle one's a little bigger, but those are the foil details right there in black uh, for the Hedgy, AKA Quilson foiled washi. She also has a light gold foiled vellum, this beautiful pink. It's a light pink with white and yellow flowers. And it is that debossed where you can feel it on the back. Uh, beautiful foil and then she has this cool one too this one is like a craft color 
my craft paper color. It looks a little more green in my light, but that is just because I'm using this light that's actually over here where I'm filming on this side. Uh, and these beautiful pink flowers with these little gold accents um, lines and then there's some but there's little footprints in the design and they're super super cute but that is the second vellum in the Hedgy collection with the five washi the stamp washi the two foiled vellum the vellum tippins the two vinyl decals the sticker sheet and of course the tippins come with the tip and tape so that is the Hedgy collection I hope you guys really, really love her, Miss Quilson. Okay, up next is the Rainbow of Us. We're gonna start off with these beautiful foiled, copper rose gold foiled sticky notes. Um, so we're just gonna pull one off. Let's stick it down and see. They're kind of this minty green color with this stunning little rainbow and this floral bouquet. So those are the foiled vellum sticky notes. So stunning. Of course, what would a collection be without a vinyl decal? So this is a little bit larger than the first vinyl decal that we did for Rainbow of Us. So this is the Rainbow of Us decal. Okay, this one I have a full sticker sheet of. <laughs> this is the Rainbow of Us sticker sheet. And as you can see, I use these stickers in my monthly spread. If you've been hanging around and watching my feed post, you will have seen these before. Uh, so they are really, really gorgeous and I have really enjoyed using them. So we have washi. We have six washi in the Rainbow of Us collection. We have this beautiful peachy pink with these little dots and leave foiled accents in the copper rose um, foil. And then we have this light, light blue green to match the mint and the florals of that beautiful, it's called Beauty. It's a 25 millimeter foil tape, so it's about this wide. Uh, then we have this Us, and this is foiled rainbows, which just hold on one second and uh, these little foiled florals, just like the for foil floral here. Wow, that's a mouthful. And then we have this with a, like more of a heavy foil pattern. And then we have just the florals foiled. And then we have just the rainbows. This is a 10 millimeter, 20, 30, 15, 25. And it says 330, but it is only 30. <laughs> so these are all the amazing washi in the Rainbow of Us collection, and they are stunning. Now, I know that we couldn't be without a stamp washi. So the Rainbow of Us has a stamp washi. Now don't mind the foil. See, you can see the foil here. It is off in this picture and that is because this was a test print. And I do have the actual foil pattern, of course, for you to see here, but I wanted just for you to see the, the beauty of the light muted colors and what that actual copper rose foil looked like. So that is the seven different stamps on the Rainbow of Us stamp washi. And here is what uh, those stamps actually look like with their appropriate foiling detail on them. Uh, they are really, really beautiful. And I really, really love this collection. So this collection does not have tippins, but it does have two vellums. This one is not foiled. It is your classic, just really thick, beautiful, crunchy, crinkly vellum, 135 GSM. And it is this beautiful rainbow design. And this one, on the other hand, is a foiled. It goes like this. Look at that copper foil shimmer and sparkle. Holy moly, it is so stunning. So this actually matches one of the washi designs and it is in the same foiling color and it is absolutely stunning. So this is the Rainbow of Us collection. So we have the vellum, the stamp washi, the stickers, the six washi, the vinyl decal, and of course the foiled vellum sticky notes and they're all releasing tomorrow. I hope you love the Rainbow of Us collection. Okay, let's go to the November collection. If you've been spying my planner for the last few days and the last feed posts, you're gonna see an abundance of the November collection. Why? Because it's pretty much my favorite. Um, but as you can see in the month of September, I used an assortment of November items mixed with the Rainbow of Us. Now, why did, we, did I do that? 
because all of the collections I'm releasing actually all match. And I will show you kind of why and how in a minute. Here is the sticker sheet for the November collection. And as you can see, this large piece went over here. And then these little florals were sporadically placed. Here is a deco. Uh, this is the largest deco that I'm releasing tomorrow uh, for the November collection. This set also has a absolutely stunning sticky note beautiful uh, taupey nude neutral color and it is foiled in this absolutely perfect copper rose foil. Of course we have the vellum tippins. These are not foiled because they are just too beautiful to distract with foiling so they are not foiled but they are absolutely gorgeous neutral floral and I don't know but if I don't think you can see it on camera but in them there is like a linen-y texture to them making them look like they're actually hand painted so there is a stunning texture in these and of course they all come with the tip and tape um, so but I know that's not really why we're all here we're all here to see the washi the washi in this collection is the largest collection of washi that I have released so far <laughs> and it is a stunning 12 washi plus stamp washi so here is the 30 millimeter floral washi the geo washi that meadow washi with that cute minty green in the back and the splatter oh my goodness that's stunning grid tortoise so beautiful um, those leaves that match the amazing um, vinyl decal. And then we go into some of these like more, um, I want to say art deco-y maybe. I don't know what you'd call them, but more decorative washi. There is the four. There's the Dusk, the Sedona, the Dawn, and the Patch. And these are all a splatter version, which it looks like I just smeared that. But these are actually a grid version. So there's three grids and four splatters that match up with the November collection. And it is just a stunning set of washi. Now, of course, I mentioned that there is a stamp washi and it is beautiful. Uh, this is what the detailing looks like on all seven of the stamp sections. And as you can see, the little stamp sections are notated here. They are all different sizes, just beautiful. And then I did put some on paper so you could see what it looked like on paper. So this is the stunning November stamp washi with that copper rose foiling. The foil will be in different locations, more noted to looking like this. So just so you know that. <laughs> And then I think my favorite pieces of this collection are the vellum. This is that debossed vellum. It has a beautiful linen texture. It is that copper rose foil and it is just so beautiful in that splatter. It does have that amazing texture on the back and it's just so, so beautiful. So that is the floral. And then y'all look at this one. <laughs> it's a full page of beautiful tortoise. It is a little more muted. It's not like a super dark. It's more of a neutral tortoise, but look at that copper rose foiling. Again, 135 GSM paper and it is debossed so you can feel the foiling on the back. But look at this. Oh my goodness. It is so, so beautiful. And then of course, I mentioned that all these match. Well, there is the Fall Classics washi as well. These are all 15 millimeter. They actually have light gold foiling, but they are in the pinks and the mint tones and then this latte in the grid and these dots. And this actually matches everything. Everything I've released in this release will match these. will match with all of them because that's just kind of how I am. I'm really matchy matchy. So I wanna say uh, farewell and I'll see you guys all at release tomorrow. Bye.